term 3 unit 3 measurement part 2 in this video we are going to learn about exercise 3.1 Exercise 3.1, first one. Tick the object which has more volume. So it's very easy for you. So among this object, we are going to put the tick that which has more volume. Right. So first one, apple or watermelon. With that size itself, we can put a tick, isn't it? So you are all excellent with that. Right. So watermelon, put a tick. And then water bottle or water drum. Yes, sure it's a drum only. Put a tick. Then chair or table. Left or right? Yes, right side. Table only. Then book or bag. Sure it's a bag only. Then pencil or pencil box. Very good. Pencil box only. These are all very easy for you. Just put a tick in your bookmark. Second one, arrange the given objects according to their volume. Yes. So, some images are given according to their volume. We have to follow this. But they didn't mention ascending or descending. But as usual, we have to start from smaller object to bigger object. Right? So, first one, here four balls are given. So, from that, we are going to fix it. This is also easy for you just to see once. So the yellow ball, it's a small one and then you mark it as one. Then second one, tennis ball, isn't it? Right. Then third is a what? Football. Then volleyball or beach ball. Okay. Then come to the second one. Here also some objects are given. From that, we are going to mark it. So, sweet box, then dictionary, eraser and uh, old model suitcase. Right? So, here also, that uh, eraser is a small, very smaller one. So, mark it as one. Second one, sweet box. Then third is a dictionary. And then fourth one, yes. Then come to the third question. Here also, one cart. Pillow, bed and sofa. So, these four images are here. Just we have to mark it. First one is pillow. Then bed. After that sofa. Then fourth one is cart. Right? So, whatever images are given, we have to mark it. Right? 